Good morning. Happy Sunday. Today you get both Linda and Lauren. Say hello, Lauren. Hi, everybody. And Welcome. we're going to talk about our list. Wing oh my gosh, what's that? <laughs> oh, Wingardium Leviosa. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is Mary Beth taking over today. The, we're calling this Mary Beth's Frightening Favorites because I am the Marigold team member who's the most in love with Halloween and fall. So I thought I'd show you some of my spooky you favorites. Have competition with Katie, I mean, yes, Katie loves Halloween too. So, but still. Yeah, but we know it's Mary Beth. <laughs> It's like my favorite holiday of the year. It's like my spiritual holiday. So I thought I would show you guys some fun stuff we've got. We've got some really like great gifty accessories that kind of fall in line with that vibe. And then after I show you those things, I'm going to take you over to some really cool DIY simple Halloween costumes that you can put together with Marigold clothing. So first we've got, we featured these before, but we just got a new pair in. Some really nice, fun, spooky Halloween socks. Get yourself in the spirit. So cute. Throw these on. These ones are called, literally called very spooky sock. <laughs> so those are up online now. And then we got a restock in of the uh, Day of the Dead skull sock. And we still have a couple candy corns. If you're looking for something for a gentleman, there's some dino socks. You know, skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> and then, oh, this is fun. We just got this uh, really cool skull scarf in from VSA. And it's kind of, you know, it's a little subtle. From a distance, it just looks like a really nice pattern. But, ooh, <laughs> you're rocking the skull vibe. I've got it here on my outfit. Love that. It's a square scarf, so that's kind of fun to play with. Um, some other fun stuff, little scratch cards, foil scratch cards for the kiddos. That's just like a little activity they can do where they scratch in designs and when they scratch when they scratch on it, like glittery foil comes up. So that's cool. Um, this is fun. We have this dictionary of dreams and I got this last year for my Halloween party and it was kind of a hit. Like basically I just be like, okay, tell me what your dream was last night. And then I'd like flip through it's like eight it's a to z of different things that might appear in a dream mm -hmm. and so it's just kind of fun either you you have it as like a fun little conversation starter or you actually use it wake up in the morning and think about try to remember what you dreamt about and be like oh i dreamt about there was like a car i was driving a lot so you go to d and you go to driving or you go to car so that could be a good accessory if you're like a fortune teller too. Right. Exactly. <laughs> right. I would say, yeah, just good like, you know, a little coffee table book. Yeah. I love mine. Um, okay. Oh, oh, and the final thing that we're showing on this accessory spooky table that, that's right here when you enter at Marigold is we just got a bunch of puzzles in and one of them I really love. It's by this company called Eboo. Oh, wow. And this one is a glow in the dark. Um, What's the word? What's the word? Zodiac. 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 That's the word I'm looking for. So it's all the zodiacs in a really cool, fun illustration. And um, I also like that the design is 360. So it's like no matter what okay. angle you're coming at the puzzle at, it's, it's always facing you, which mm -hmm. is nice if it's like two of you are working on the puzzle. And so it glows in the dark. Love it. So that's like the little nod to the spooky vibe this season. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Well, I'm going to wave my wand and then I'm going to take you over to my fun Halloween costumes. And remember, all these things are online at marigoldclothing.myshopify.com. They're under Linda's list, but obviously we know Mary Beth's taking it over. But look for Linda's list on the website to shop any of these items. All right. Ready? All right. Here we go. Now I'm ready to show you some of my favorite ideas for really easy costumes that you can make with pieces that you'll want to buy anyways, like great fall style for Marigold. Add a couple extra elements and you have a really simple DIY costume. So one of my favorites uh, is the first one I'm going to show you is the classic Gypsy. Uh, this is actually what I did for Halloween last year and it's basically just Take like a bohemian top that you have, or get this awesome Johnny Was dress that we have, and um, layer like a ton of jewelry on it. You just can't throw enough on this look. 
Um, I've had this really awesome VSA scarf around the waist for a little extra layering. I'm gonna pull back and show you that I, I put a skirt underneath the dress. So just, again, it makes it longer, it makes it look more bohemian, more gypsy-like. And then you gotta complete the look with a scarf on your head. You know, that really makes, makes the final outfit. Add yourself some big hoop earrings, do some dang dangly jewelry. You look gorgeous. See, that one's easy and fun and beautiful. And then here, I'll give you a, a, a look at what the Johnny Was dress looks like without the scarf on it, because it's just a, a great dress that you want to treat yourself to. You know, you can wear this dress when you get together with people, if you get together with a small group at the holidays, or if you're doing Zoom meetings, or you're going into work like us Marigold team members are. So yeah, Johnny Was dress. Okay, so now the next super easy, fun DIY costume idea is, ta-da, a cat. <laughs> How easy is this? Just, you know, we featured this before in Lauren's list, I think. Leopard print planet top. And then we just got these fun berets um, from Toucan Hats that have leopard prints on them. There's this gray one. And then there is uh, a tan one. So you could, you could go cat print that way, or you could switch out the beret and add some cat ears. See, simple, easy. And this top is awesome. And one size fits all, great top for fall. There's two left, so if you want it, make sure you get online or call us and get it. All right, next one up. Down the line of the next easy costume idea, Mary Beth's DIY costumes, the devil. This is basically just take a really awesome red top or jacket, add some devil ears. You're a stylish devil. This is a Fanini fleece line jacket that we just love. It's got really great lining. It's got really beautiful texture, like this little like crusty black look. And I paired it over a Fanini um, thermal top, which is also equally really nice. It has some really nice details, like a little pocket detail there. So this is just a jacket and a top you'll want for fall anyways. And then you can just add some devil horns and you're in the Halloween spirit. Okay. All right, so um, the next costume is my kind of funny topical costume, you know, like a 2020 costume, but also really easy. So the idea is you take a black, long black dress or a black robe that you have. For example, we have this Magnolia Purple um, black robe and you put a lace collar or lacy looking, necklace on it and you're Ruth Bader Ginsburg. See how easy and fun is that? Here I'll give you some uh, close-up of the details. So the Magnolia Pearl um, robe I would say it's like a jacket. It's got these little clasps right here. It's got like amazing embroidery detail. I'll take the collar off. It's got this really nice velvet collar. The back is cool too. So yeah, this is just a treat yourself kind of awesome show-stopping piece from Magnolia Pearl that you could really enjoy having in your closet and then you just pop like a crazy cool expressive necklace or collar on it and then put your hair up in a bun and you're Ruth Bader Ginsburg. See if you can see that on my lace collar. Hey, if anybody wants to be Ruth Bader Ginsburg, Magnolia Pearl jacket, which is jacket, which is the only one that we have, I will give you the lace collar for free. It's a Mary Beth frightening fall favorite special. I'll be, I just, I just really want to see if anybody wants to be Ruth Bader Ginsburg for Halloween. So I just think that'd be funny, like you're walking around a fall festival and you're rocking this look. 
So yeah, so that's one of my favorite ideas for Halloween this year. I'm gonna push these guys back and then I'll talk about the, the last video I have, which is the easy, other easiest idea. And that's just rocking a witch hat and a black dress and you're a witch. So yeah, here, let me step back. See, I've got this um, Simply Dress on cowl neck. I paired a skull, the skull scarf that I talked about earlier with it. I put a petit pois underneath it. Let me get a little back up even more so you can see the, the bottom of the Simply Dress, which has really got some nice pleating. So this is just a super comfy dress that I would love to rock on any day. And you add a cool witch's hat to it. Maybe you have a wand. Oh, get yourself some, some kicky boots with it. And there you go. You're a witch for Halloween here in the spirit. Um, I'm not really sure if a lot of people are doing anything for Halloween, but maybe you just want to feel like you're getting into the season with it. You're going to pumpkin patch, you walk around your neighborhood, you're going to some kind of like fall event in your community, or maybe you're actually doing some kind of safe trick-or-treating and you're kind of having fun with it. So yeah, those are my Marybeth's DIY costumes with awesome fall style marigolds. Well, thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed and I hope you feel inspired this spooky season.